I can't get the easy job. It's always me exploring. I mean, I guess it's the most exciting one, but in a day, the life or death situation, I'd rather have the boring one than the exciting one. Oh, great. Look at that. Already got murdered. <laughs> Hello guys, and welcome back to some more Resident Evil Revelations. Uh, we are gonna see what happens next. Uh, we escaped uh, the Queen Zenobia. And now we're hearing O'Brien's story about Terra Grecia. How would O'Brien know this, though? Are we in hell? Yes. They call it Terra Grecia. Can I just shoot her? No. <laughs> oh, we didn't remember how much I had left. Right. We should get to the command room. To the command room. Oh boy. We have to hurry. Your HQ is done for. How about that, huh? Little fist to the face. Exactly, have any resources left here? Commissioner Lansdale was right. Yeah, the boss has pushed for an expansion of the FBC's purview. This is just the kind of thing he was warning the world about. And this incident will bring the crisis to the limelight. It could be good PR, really. Yeah. Maybe the international community will finally get the message. The FBC has a lot of growing to do. Just waiting. Oh. Damn these things. Is that the. So this is before we go down and Grimmer. help out. Jessica, help me. Roger. I will fight you. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. We have to get rid of it. And I have to pick this up. Handgun ammo. Really? I hate this slow pistol he has. It is such an annoyance. Okay, well that was a pain, but we did it. Hey buddy, we can get you out of here now. It's okay, I'll be fine. You're hurt bad. Don't try to act tough. All right, somebody lend him a shoulder. Parker? Yeah, but I don't have any ammo, though. But I can still fight. You're not convincing me. Come on, grab on. It's already on your shoulder, dude. We can't pull out yet. There are civilians out there. We have to do something. Heavily outnumbered. We have to regroup. How did they pull this off with just a few dozen men? Who armed them? The BOWs. These terrorists must be brought to justice. Blast it. Yeah, that's very, very sad. Very crazy thing happening. Are you kidding me? It was just one of them. Earn some stripes before you get yourself killed. At least I can somewhat fight. That's always positive.
Uh, do I have to go? What what way do I have to go? Not this one, I suppose. Look at this way anyway. Might be something good in here. Like uh, you never know, ammo maybe. A grenade, a grenade works too, and ammo. I mean, health is also super nice, so that's good. <laughs> that's how you know it's a game from 2010. Can't read the text. Actually, it's from 2012 as far as I understand. Gotta go recruit, then uh, recruit Michelle. Not good. You're losing blood. It's too dangerous to move. He needs immediate first aid. We should be okay here. something to bandage him up we'll be back cadet don't go anywhere everything will be okay all right let's go parker okay are we gonna go all the way back again What do you mean, guys and little games? Give you little games. The one who betrays me in the future and gets me killed. Can you say fourth floor is this one? So this is an area we were in before when we tried to clear the building and try to escape, right? I think it's the same place. Yeah, this is where we were, okay. Oh, there's another one. Okay, I didn't even see you. Big ouch. Okay, I got it. Turn it, kid, huh? Here we are. Just what I needed. This should do for the meantime. Don't know how well Brian knows all of this. Did someone just tell him? I don't. I don't get it. <laughs> I get that I want to show show stuff from the past, but though Brian is not even him, how does he know? I don't worry, we're on the way. Don't take it out on him. It's not his fault. Um, excuse me. Oh, 
Oh boy. Okay, buddy, we're getting big again. I don't think this is the way, right? Did I did I go wrong? I, I think I went the wrong way. Whoops. Order you to stay alive. Isn't that the same as saying, I will kill you if you die? You better stay alive. Oh, hello, they're just waiting for me outside. I'm fine. They might. Hey, the hell's out good there. Just leave the fighting to us. We'll show you how it's done. Okay. Any more? Safe and sound. Now we can take care of our little cadet. Indeed we can. So let's do so. How bad are you hurt? All right, cadet. Now you owe me one. Hey, I get it. You want justice served. No more heroics. End up getting the whole unit killed. the pain. I should be able to walk. Then follow us. The elevator to the command room is right there. Okay, to the command room. Think you can move, Cadet? I can fend off anything that comes our way. Trying to jump out of my way. Little does he know, I can't hit anyway. Don't even have to jump. They might even jump into my bullets by accident. I mean, he's smarter than you are, Parker, that's for sure. If you don't question what you do, then you're doing it wrong. You're supposed to question what you're told and then act accordingly. If you always just listen to what you're told, then you can be taken advantage of. This is not a military as far as I understand, so there's no just punishment for just questioning things. I know you're hurt, but try to keep up, cadet. Oh, we're here? Why why are we oh yeah, because the elevator goes all the way up. I'm just gonna create a paradox picking up all the ammo before you know it's needed. Okay, I mean a little ammo here and a little ammo there. Doesn't hurt nobody, does it? Now? There we go, perfect. I'm gonna go get some more ammo over here. You don't mind me doing so right? I don't think so. It's all good. I 
I guess this used to be everything for now. Oh, is the elevator up top? Am, have I mistaken something? Probably is, isn't it? Whoopsie. Up there. Let's go! Give him some cover. I mean, he's not... He's fine. Look at that. We'll take care of this. Death, you'll find shelter in the command room. Yes, I'm on my oh. way. Yeah, I the face. Ow. I'll be going over here, actually. There's some stuff over here I'd like to take a look at. And by stuff to take a look at, I mean the ammo and stuff. I would hope so. Let's hit the command room. Yeah, let's do it. you just fine. That is simply splendid news. Everything is in perfect order. Enjoy the rest of the celebration on the Queen Dido, Norman. Morgan, you intended for the virus to break out on our ship? Well, we've certainly been had. I'm not done yet. You still have an important purpose. The ship serves as a controlled environment, and the data on your mutation will serve a venerable purpose. The boldness of your self-absorbed ambitions is impressive. I am always disgusted by what you Americans can dream up. I will take that as a compliment. We knew that you could end up being a liability. So we've kept video records of all of our interactions. If they go public, your life is finished. You may do as you please. Use of the satellite has been approved. The new virus will be completely eradicated. You bastard! <laughs> Full soon shall thou be where thine eye shall answer make to thee of this, seeing the cause which raineth down the blast. We were so close. So this is before. Sorry, you were right all along. Thank God, somebody was on top of things. Don't be so hard on yourself, Parker. Now it's my turn to save you. Come on. We're getting out of here. That's the spirit, Cadet. Wait, so, so is this at the same time? Was not who we see. So we set this trap together. The whole Veltro Revival Act. The mountain hideout, the coordination of the ships, all to put heat on Morgan. But sir, couldn't you have at least told us? I couldn't risk it. Not with a mole inside the BSAA. My apologies. All that work, and both the Zenobia and the Samiramis. Yeah, I know. But I haven't given up yet. Keith and Quinn, they've left us with an ace in the hole. The data analysis they sent us, the results are in. Well, what were they? We assumed 
Veltro made use of two sister ships in the Terra Grigia panic. But there was a third. Oh, the Sano or whatever they, they called it. And then there were three. Alright, let's get it done. This should be the last episode as well. Seems like Parker might still live still. If, if that if that takes place after he already fell down, that means he should be okay. Previously Although I'm not sure. On Resident Evil Revelations. Come clean with us, O'Brien. Don't leave anything out. Everything is in perfect order. Enjoy the rest of the celebration on the Queen Dido. Norman. Oh, Dido, that one, yes. Raymond realized that Morgan was not who he seemed. So we set this trap together. The whole Veltro revival act. The mountain hideout, and the coordination of the ships, all to put heat on Morgan. But I haven't given up yet. They've left us with an ace in the hole. The queen is dead. Well, that would be kind of sad if that came out during a queen dying in real life. Yes, Queen Dido. She's Dido. been resting on the ocean floor since that day. Which means we'll find her. A Terra Grigia. Exactly. We have a responsibility to see this mission through. O'Brien out. show over. The BSAA is hereby under the direct supervision of the FBC. Clive R. O'Brien, you are under arrest for collaborating with the terrorist organization Veltro. Chris, Jill, you're our only hope. Don't say that out loud. Remains of Terra Grigia. And the Queen Dido. Approaching drop off point. Drop off point. I don't get to see them jump in, we just underwater. Okay. Okay, you want me to turn or... Oh, there we go. Search the sunken ship. If it's a sister ship, it should be the exact same thing as the other one, right? It'd be great if you could shoot underwater. <laughs> a bit of a pain to not be able to shoot. Um, found on the beach. They came from here. 
That explains why Morgan cordoned off the area. I like the quiet in the background. <laughs> Oh, those were sharks. Great. Why sharks of all things? Couldn't it have been anything else? Literally anything else other than sharks. Well, at least then it can't get inside, so that's, that's positive, right? Maybe there's some air holes in here or something. Oh, hello there. Can't scan you. At least he died a human, more or less. I wonder if those corpses on the beach were Veltro. Something oh, still Oh, great. Careful. You won't be able to fight them off underwater. No, yeah, but I can run away. Like a coward. That's something I'm very good at as well. I don't even know where it went. Those locked. It's an electric lock. I hope the emergency power still works. The wires are all pulled apart. I'll fix them. Okay, I'll see if I can get the power going. I can't get the easy job. It's always me exploring. I mean, I guess it's the most exciting one, but in a day, the life or death situation, I'd rather have the boring one than the exciting one. Oh, great. Look at that. Already got murdered. <laughs> See, let me fix the wires. I'm better at that. Come on. Uh, oh yeah, I might have to use the pulse uh, grenade now. Uh, the electric one, I think, is the pulse one. Oh, I can't even equip. Uh, maybe it's the one I already have then. I can't turn the camera without really turning myself here, so... Swim, DL, swim! Oh god, I do not like this one at all. Wait, where am I even going? Oh, I see what I'm doing. Is that pattern to them? Can't really see if there is or not. Oh god, of course. I didn't even see that one. I'm all the way back here again. <laughs> I don't know. All right, cool, cool. Down over here. So every single time I go into like a, another area that is, they could be in. Stop. Can I? You cannot see me. Oh, I'm gonna have to exit this place again. Oh my goodness. There we go indeed. Chill, the door's open. Okay, on my way back. Back to Chris. I am on my way back to Chris already here. Um Okay, there we go. That was close. You got killed two times. I wouldn't call that close, <laughs> but sure. Okay, let's move in.
Ja, Luke. Probably air. There's still air. Who's that? He hasn't been dead for long. He's FBC. There's something in his hand. Oh, could he be the one he spoke with? But then why is he has he not been dead for long? Voice recorder. This is Agent Dario Barioni of the FBC Armed Forces. The time is 1948. I request that this recorder be handed over to General Lansdale. If found by the next team, everyone on my team is dead. Killed by the devil himself. We were unable to retrieve the video log. Our mission has failed. Weltro, they weren't sitting around waiting for death to come to them. When the FBC arrived, they were waiting for us. Even though Terra Grigio was a year ago. Thoughts of revenge kept them alive. Well, um... That's great, so uh, they're still alive, huh? I guess we'll figure out how and why in the next video, because I'm going to have to end this one right here. I hope you guys enjoyed watching. If you did, consider liking, subscribing, and sharing. Hope to see you in the next one, and as always, stay awesome.